Hello guys, today we're gonna fix this uh, microwave oven, a uh, sharp microwave oven that has a problem with the uh, uh, no heating. Even though the unit itself it's on to the power. It's on but no heating. So uh I'm gonna try to open this unit and check what's going wrong inside. Okay, let's get started. Okay, first we need to turn off the machine. And we have one, two, three, four, five screws from behind. Okay, this is the inner organ of our oven and microwave. First, I need to check all the fuse. We have uh, two fuse here, the ceramic type. I'm checking with the multimeter with this uh, diode and continuity test position. Let's check the small fuse first. Yes, we have no connection from the small fuse. We have connection from the big fuse. Yes, we have connection from the big fuse. And this is the small fuse. There are no connection from the small fuse. So I think the fuse is blown. Yes, the fuse is blown. There are no connection. There are no connection from this fuse. Okay, if you see there are a small text here. It is very hard to read, so usually I'm, I'm taking a picture and make a zoom so I can read the text. So I believe this is a 8 ampere and 250 volt fuse. It is a ceramic type. The, the ceramic type is uh, more safety than the regular one with glass. It prevents uh, breaking the glass when it's a suddenly jump of electricity. So. Uh, yeah, we are going to find this uh, replacement. Okay guys, I have this uh, new uh, fuse, the ceramic fuse. It's uh, 8 ampere, 250 volt. You need to check with multimeter. This is a continuity test, diode and continuity test. See, it's uh, connecting. We are going to replace this. I checked, this is already blown. This is the old fuse, this is a new fuse. Okay, now let's try the microwave. We turn on the power. And we open the door. Uh, the lamp lights up. And I'm gonna use this uh, glass of water for testing if it's uh, boiling or not. Okay, let's try, put inside. And now we press start. Just the fan is moving. Okay, the fan. 
time stop moving. Now we open the door. Yeah, it's it's boiling. I guess the microwave is fixed now. That has problem before with uh, no heating. Okay, if after you're changing this uh, fuse, and if the fuse keep blowing, after you warming up the food, uh, after one minute, two minutes, it's uh, blowing again and uh, often not getting hot again. So you may need to check the capacitor. Here in the down corner, there are a big capacitors. Usually this capacitor is already leaking or uh, failing. So you need to check or replace this. For checking this capacitor, you need to be extra careful because sometimes it still have an electric shock inside. It's a AC electricity. So you need to empty this capacitor charge with this uh, screwdriver or any metal and make it the both leg short like this. Make it both leg short and then you can remove or you can check with your multimeter or you can empty the capacitor with uh, two cables connecting to the light bulbs and the light bulbs will be on and then dim and dimmer indicates that the electricity is uh, already empty and then after that you can make a replacement or checking for checking a capacitor you may need to use this uh, multimeter as you can see I have these two symbol this is for a uh, Omega symbol for resistance and this is for capacitance symbol for capacitors we can switch select usually there are uh, F letters and F is sent for a uh, nanofarad microfarad depending of the size of the capacitors if the reading showing below or a half value from the stating from the capacitor body then it's definitely you need to replace the capacitors because it will make the fuse keep blowing again and again and your oven will not getting heat again okay guys don't forget to subscribe like and share if you like this channel and it will support me making more videos in the future and again thank you very much terima kasih and bye bye